everybody, my name is DJ, and I'm here today to bring another brand new video, and today we are back with some more Unturned 333. This is Unturned 3.0, where you get three kills with three separate guns in Unturned 3.0. As I just said, today is our final episode of the series. This is episode number eight, and we will be taking on Hawaii. We're going to be going to the last curated map, the last official or curated map available. This is Hawaii, and we're going to go in and just see how fast we can beat this this game. See how fast we can uh, complete this challenge in Unturned Hawaii map. Oh, I apologize for yawning, guys. Um, as you guys can tell, probably, I'm recording this directly after recording the last episode. So I just wanted to get them all completed so we can get moving on to our brand new Saturday or new Sunday series very, very shortly. It is super bright. You can see even the glare in the actual game screen. So, we actually dropped quite in a decent spot. We ended up dropping right by the unveiling HQ. So we may be able to get three guns right here. Entering safe zone. I am very happy with the weather we're having lately. Glad to hear it. Lit! So we actually dropped near a safe zone. So, who knows? We may be able to find three weapons right here and then just jump off and head off to a... Uh, head off and find a zombie. A few zombies and just get them, get them killed. Quite interesting. Now, I don't remember the last time I played this game and found myself in a safe zone. I feel actually the last time I did that was the last time I actually touched 3.0. Or was the first time I touched 3.0. Whoa. Lieutenant Bob. Neil. Captain Reginald. Major Lee. Commander something. Commander Norton. Commander Barlow. It's pretty lit, actually. But I don't think there's going to be any drops here. So I'm going to exit the safe zone. And I'm actually going to head off there. I'm pretty sure that that's not a safe zone. Exiting safe zone, yes. That means there will be zombies out here. And this, we're entering right here. We're entering another part of the HQ this looks like a old construction site so we may be able to find some weapons here but I'm not sure if we will be able to took quite a bit of damage there because I did not get a a melee weapon before I started off into here so I'm going to try and just look around real quick see if I can find a hammer or something anything of use that I can use to defend myself until I find some melee weapons or some actual guns so we don't get killed that is a sledgehammer I mean that can do for now it's not ideal but it will do that is a nail gun we could use that but if you guys remember episode 6 when we went to Cyprus, I evoked the ability to use that because it's kind of cheap. Because I don't know really what you would define that as per like a regular weapon. Or if that would be kind of like the bow and arrow kill. So I kind of just um, vetoed using that as a, a gun kill. Even though it is considered a gun in this game versus a tool. Oh, that sucks. That weapon sucks. It's a very poor weapon to use. Alrighty. So it doesn't seem as if there's anything of use here. So we're gonna have to make our way back down. 
and out of the construction zone and move ourselves on because there's nothing of use here. What's that? Just a metal bar. Nothing nothing great here to use. I'm just going to make my way back up out of this area and probably off in some, probably towards the Keanu Resort. May be able to find something there, possibly, but I'm not sure. That looks like there's some radiation there. Entering a dead zone. That's what I figured. Yes, that's all radiation poisoning. Because there are radiation barrels there. Idiot. What is that? Oh, it's just a flower. Oh, that's cool. Never seen that before. Huh. Don't know if that does anything. <coughs> but down here is the Keanu Resort. Or at least is the outskirts of the Keanu Resort. So... This will be able to help us in a little bit. Hopefully, we can find ourselves a weapon of some sort here that we can use to defend ourselves. Oh, I apologize again for the yawning, guys. I'm very sleepy. I did not sleep great last night as of recording this. So, but I got to get a lot recorded because, as you guys know, um, actually, by the time this video is uploaded, I will be back from my vacation, I believe. <sighs> or I will be... No, this will be the Sunday while I'm on vacation. You guys know that I'm on vacation right now, and I don't have the ability to record, so I have to get all my recording done in bulk right now. That's a baseball bat. That's just a little bit better. Drop that. Put that in my inventory. There's a gnat or a fly or something flying around my desk. And it's irritating me. I'm going to grab some of these colas here. Because those can be useful. Black trunks and green swim trunks. I don't believe there's going to be any guns sitting around out here? Probably not. But I mean, <laughs> might as well get the kills while I'm out here. Just get a little bit of experience so we can actually get a little bit more stamina. Because if it comes to that, I have no problem with spending some experience points that I haven't been doing and spending it on stamina and stuff. The PC is deciding to be loud right now. Which I don't appreciate. Three hits and you're dead. Oh, he has a revolver clip. An ace clip. That means there may be a possibility of finding an ace around here somewhere. The only thing is, there's no way of finding a vehicle. So we will be just walking our asses around. Which is unfortunate, but it is alright. That is a bottle of water. Some wheat. Grab the candy bars because they may be the only source of food that we find. So, don't want to be caught without any food. I'm running low on health, so I'm going to grab as much as I can whilst I'm here while I'm doing my travels. Because a lot of my travels will be walking travels. <coughs> Hammer and a baseball bat. Nothing nothing spectacular. Can I sneak up here without getting any attraction? Binoculars. Nothing spectacular. Nothing of note, really. Just an umbrella, which I will equip real fast, just to jump out the window. 
Cool. Can I equip that to three? Yes, I can. And I can just hit three and I'll get my umbrella. Cool. So unfortunately, no, nothing at the Keanu Resort. Um, Wyola maybe has something, but I feel like Pahala, which is the more central city, will have something a little bit better for me because it's actually a city area in Hawaii. Um, but yeah, this is our whole land resort. Uh, Kaleokona is probably our best bet to find everything or the Al Ala, uh, Alaka base, Alika base, but Pahala and Kiau may be useful just to find some stuff in this half of the region. If I end up doing an unturned, like a legitimate unturned series, this may be the actual area that I decide to do it because of how expansive and how uh, pretty the landscape is. And just because it's, I've never played, uh, the last time I did an unturned series with Team Vanta, um, we did it in PEI because that was the only map available. Now there's eight total maps. I bring myself to a camp. I didn't know there was a camp out here. I could find a weapon or two over right here. You never know. Poor experience off of that kill there. There's a sport shot mag there. Fishing top. Another top. An arrow. Nothing really of use in the fridges. There's a snorkel. That is a Swiss Army knife. Cool, so I can drop my bat now and just use the pocket knife as my main weapon of choice. Because that's just a little bit more useful. There's a canteen and a bottle of water. Um, that is a sports shot. That is our first weapon that we can use. Now I would like to see if I find a bow and arrow first before I use it. There is a Shawfield, which I believe is a ri a battle rifle, and that is also a rifle. So I can only use one of them because they are both considered rifle weapons. It's a bedroll. And what do we find ourselves in here? Just more uh, ammo. So canned tomato soup. So we are running a little bit low on water and food. So I'm just going to do a little bit of eating up here. All right, so we need to make our way to uh, Pahala, which is up this way. So we are almost there. So hopefully we can find a pistol and a bow and arrow or a pistol and a shotgun in there. Preferably, if there's a uh, police station, we can find a, a pistol and a blunt force, which is a shotgun in this game. Which it looks like there's a police station right there, which is gorgeous. That looks like it could be a police station. That's generally what the colors are for a police station in this game. Are the Oh, and there's also a gun shop. Or well, that could be a botanist shop. That is a... That is a uh, police station because there is a jail. So we may be able to find our final weapons here. There's also a motorbike in there too. Take you out. Alrighty. Police station. What do we have chilling in here? Anything of use. We have pistols and we have blunt forces. Blunt force, and a pistol, and a police vest. Why not? Screw it. All right, so we got a blunt force, which is an American shotgun. We have a Cobra, which is an Australian pistol. And then we have a sports shot, which is a, uh, I think that said, an American target shooting. So, get kill number one, or not. Or not, okay. Alright, that is kill number one with the sport shot. 
Now we have the blunt force, which is a rifle. Oh, let's screw it. Let's just ride the police motorcycle over. And let's bring out the sport shot here. Pop him in the head. And then let's switch to the Cobra really fast. My mouse doesn't leave my screen. And get our pistol kills. So, we have just finished our unturned 333 in Hawaii. And that also means that we have finished our unturned 333 series. Because we have finally got all three kills in the three different areas. And we have finished unturned three, three, three. So everything is left to go. We are done. That is unturned three, three, three completed because we have finished our adventures in Hawaii because we got our pistol, shotgun, and rifle kill. So I hope you all have enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely smack that like button down below. Comment below what you see on this channel. Also, subscribe and tick that notify bell so you get notified every single time I go live with a brand new video. I hope you all have enjoyed this video and this series. And I will see you guys with a brand new Sunday series next Sunday. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, guys. I just totally botched my outro.